Hey everyone, welcome to another Ray's way of doing things with the loon where I'm going to show you how amazing Cartier is especially for Alliance boss. Now my team for Alliance boss is going to be the physical team and as you can see we have Balder, Nasari, Lilith who are going to be my main damage dealers and we have Cartier as an extra support for damage as well as Weiwei able to heal as well as boost up our damage by 98%. And don't forget guys your potions, you want your crit rate as well as your crit power so you're able to do the most damage you can. Mine's only plus uh, 4 star and I don't feel like getting 5 star yet because that's a lot of gold. We have Nasari here for the debuff which is physical defense down by 75% as well as being able to just do a lot of damage on her own. We have Lilith who is going to be amazing in her own which is able to just auto attack and let Balder auto attack because of her succubus charm. That's why we're in Iron Wall, so we're able to have that 90% chance to gain one soul when attacking. Then we have our Balder, who is going to be our main damage dealer, and we're trying to shoot for 3 million damage in this fight. And as you noticed, we are in Spirit Set because it's the best damage that you could possibly hope for. Actually, let's just boost up these boots real quick. Now that I'm thinking about it, because the more physical defense you have, the more soul damage you can do. Because that's how the uh, Trent works. So once we get these uh, boots leveled up real quick, doesn't matter what stats they are for me at the moment. Alright, cool. Hey, we'll do look at that. We got crit power, even better. Alright, now we are fully physical defense, and we have physical or sorry we have spirit on all of our damage dealers so we have spirit on balder we have spirit on nasari and we have spirit on our lilith where is she there she is all right we have spirit on our Lilith as well so the whole purpose is to get the most attacks out on the alliance boss now let's talk about our main star of today cartia she has the abilities to boost your team by using her draw a card ability. She's able to draw a card in random number between 0.1 of her attack and 0.65 of her attack. And it also heals her based on the draw number. So basically you want to look at the heal to see how much you get. And what you can do with that draw card is release it. By releasing it, it's 90% of the number of the card for 4 turns. And the card will disappear after use. What's really cool about the her card, draw card effect, is that Wing of Fate. When you draw a card, you are able to have another draw card, and it will cost 0 in possession of a card. And then you have Inspiration. Now this can crit rate. It's applied to a card, and when it's crit, Crit damage is applied to the card number as well. And let's just tell you, it can go high. Then we have Fragment of Fate, which allows you a 50% chance of receiving a turn immediately when the number of the card is smaller than 20%. So this allows you to keep boosting your attack of the card as much as possible. Alright, now that we know what the abilities do, let's actually go into the fight and see how well we can do today. Uh, like I said, I'm shooting for 3 million. Um, now that I have her plus 1. Let's, uh, hopefully we can reach that. Alright, so we got the full number that we could get at the moment. So we're going to release that once we uh, are able to. Alright, we were able to get that soul that we needed. Alright, we're just going to auto attack uh, so we can get Nasari to be able to actually use her uh, ability. 
Hey, look at that. We even have that spirit work in effect. Yeah, no, we're just gonna hover over her ability. So we could get 13,000 if we wanted to, but right now we already have 12,266. So that's good enough for me. So I'm just gonna release it right now. All right, now we could have full damage if we wanted to. Um, but I'm going to just AoE ult, or AoE his. So, because we have another turn to use his ability. Then we're just going to um, auto attack so we can keep doing as most, much damage as possible. Then we're going to swap with our Wei Wei so we could get our AoE heal up. Because otherwise we're going to get hit really hard and we want our people to survive. Alright, there we go. Alright, we're just going to um, auto attack with uh, Nasari real quick. Or we could just keep attacking. Cool. Alright, free damage. Can't swap, so. Sweet. Alright, so uh, we're going to ult right here because I want Nasari to have her damage boost again. And then just going to keep drawing card. We could get up to 20, 22,000 almost. And we got to 19,900. So that's a, that's a pretty good one. Alright, once it's uh, Weiwei's turn, we're going to release that card. Right here. Oh, nope. Right, you know, might as well just go for another one. Oof, 10,000. That's uh, pretty low. <laughs> a lot lower than last one. That's okay, we're going to keep going for it. Because we get all unlimited chances when it's zero. Oof, zero again. I mean, 10,000 again. It's not much of an increase. Alright, we keep going. Free auto attacks. Look at this. <laughs> We're already at 16 souls, so we can't gain any more. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're trying to go for the highest uh, amount of damage that we could actually put out. All right, we're back to uh, the last one we could do. Oh, wow, that's uh, really unfortunate. That we were not able to actually uh, get what we needed. Because now we have to start all over, back to 13,000. And at least we got it. All right, I'm just going to ultimate with uh, Nasari. Yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah, so we're just trying to get that, that most damage. And unfortunately, we're not lucky enough this time around. So keep in mind, guys, that if you're not lucky, just if you get a high number, if it's between, you know, 2,000, 3,000 difference from your highest number, just use it. So, as you can see, 13,000, I'm just going to use it real quick. So, we could have the best damage. Alright, now we get the ult. Eh, it's not too bad. I'm going to um, swap with Lilith. Hopefully, we get our um, soul sweet. And Balder and Soul Set um, Iron Wall is just completely amazing when it's paired up with Lilith. All right, so now we get another chance to get to twenty-two thousand almost, and it's five thousand. Okay, that's a pretty uh, pathetic number. And I'm gonna go again. 3,000. Oh, look at that. We get that rechance. 50% chance. Hey, there we go. We got it finally. Probably just going to use uh, Nasari's ult if I have it up. 
And I do. 99,000. Alright, so now we know that we have the card. We're going to use it and release it by using your ult. Now, Balder has 47,000 attack. This is just amazing. Especially because it won't fall off with Lola's attacks either. As you can see, Balder still has 2-3. Alright, we're gonna... Um, let's see, what do we need to do? I might as well just ult. That way we could actually have Lilith do a little bit more damage. Now we're just going to hope for a blaze. Because we've been needing them. Alright, we got the blaze up. Now let's uh, hopefully for a health down. Alright, we got health down. <laughs> Alright, now we could go up to 27,000. Let's hope for a crit. 17,000, so that's not too bad. But I'm not satisfied. Let's go again. Hey, crit! 37,000. Alright, I'm going to save the ult for both Balder and um, Nasari. Especially because I have uh, three burning sacks. I want the most damage that we could possibly do. Hey, look at that. Just keep, keep giving me them. Keep giving me it. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna um, AOE heal because it was uh, knocked off, sadly. And let's uh, release this card. Oof, that's a lot of damage. So now Nasari is in risk of dying. Let's. Um, let's see, what can we do? Actually, yeah, let's swap to her and use her ability. Whew, 100,000, that's not bad either. It didn't crit, but really great for her kit. Alright, she's probably going to die, die right here. Oh, luckily not. Now we could get up to 37,000. <laughs> That's funny. Hopefully we get a crit. That would be a freaking amazing. Hey, we get to go again. Alright, now we could actually use our ult on this boss. And hopefully we will be able to uh, get a good one. Yeah, we're just uh, gonna ultimate. Oof, actually, um, swap real quick. There we go. Full damage. Hopefully, it's a. Uh, oh my god, a demon crit. That's that's a feels bad. Sixty four thousand um, attack that Balder has, and he couldn't even get a crit off. That's that's unfortunate. Alright. Go, Balder, go. Oh my gosh, now he crits? <laughs> and then we have low soul because this is just amazing. Yeah, I can I couldn't even get the activation because of low soul. That's okay. Um as you guys see the potential for Cartier is amazing and we almost hit that three million damage. Um Actually, no, we hit it. Yeah, we, we definitely hit it. Based off of um, Lilith and Nasari combined with Baldur's. I was just hoping for um, Baldur to be able to have 3 million damage by himself. But as you can see, Karte is amazing at being able to do long fights. And she is going to up your guys' damage like super high. So... If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, 
share with the newer players, and hopefully you guys compete with the higher alliances for free. All right, I'm out.